Hey, what's up everybody? We are back for another episode here. We've been busy with the holidays, busy with everything going on. River's been blown out because of the rain and snow, but my buddy said yesterday it was around 8.30. Now it's down to like 4.40, so that's uh, fishable anyway. <laughs> it, it should be about 7, 8, 9 inches of visibility, which is better than two or three so we're gonna go go try and catch some fish today should be good the rain blew out the river so it should be pretty good um, beings that nobody's fished it for a good week and a half two weeks so we're gonna go out there and hopefully catch one I just want to catch one fish and then do a little catch and cook and switch it up a little bit I got a good little recipe for the cold winter days here so yeah, stick around. It should be a good day. I got some eggs to throw at them. I'm going to try some beads, some jigs. We're going to try a little bit of everything today. And hopefully catch a fish for you guys so you guys can see my good little recipe I got for for some steelhead. So stick around, man. I think we're going to get them today. It's been a while, man. I got the itch. I got the itch to catch fish. Itching to go fishing. <laughs> How's that go? Itching to fish and I forget how it goes. <laughs> but anyway, yeah, hang out, man. We're gonna get us get ourselves a, a fish to cook, for catch and cook today. So we'll see you guys on the riverbank. I'm just waiting for Bo. He's inside getting his boots on. I'm warming up the truck. So hey, we'll see you guys out there. Alrighty, we're just getting to the river here. Get our stuff going. Still looks pretty colored up, but it's better than yesterday. So I know there's fish in here because they were rolling around pretty good yesterday before dark. So the fish are in here. We just gotta try and get something in front of their faces that they're gonna want to eat. That's the plan. That's what we're gonna do, right? So. Yeah. But I'll be right down there. Yeah, we're back on the river. The we're gonna uh, fish for a while. Hopefully catch a fish. And yeah, we'll see you guys on the bank. All right, we're back on the muddy river. What's that? Yeah. Well, they're biting, that's good. Only thick. Where'd he bite it at? Oh yeah. Have to check it out. Bo would like it. Yeah. Oh, do you have a fish? Is it a fish? Yeah. Johnny's hooked up. Coho? Looks heavy. Oh, it looked bright, Johnny. Look bright. I know. What's that, Dad? Yeah. Oh yeah. 
it's bright. Bright and good size. Looks heavy. Yeah, it is. Johnny's eggs are hot, boy. Oh, yeah. See that tail? Yeah. Lift him a little bit more. <laughs> it's a good one. See him. Oh, turned his head on me. My butt of my pole ran into something back. Oh, my bag. You want to move down a little bit or stay here? He's coming back. No, that's you don't net him like that. It scares him. You got to dip him fast. Just like that. Cool. <laughs> it's a nice one, yeah, Johnny. Yeah. Some good ones yeah, that's a fatty. That other one looks like that. Sucker hit it twice. He hit it twice. He hit it up here, felt him tap it, and then he hit it again. Oh no, I hate losing. <laughs> sure felt like a good bite. <laughs> ah, he was bright too. Yeah. Son of a biscuit, man. Nothing worse than losing fish, especially when you're working hard for it. I know. Yeah. 
Yeah. <laughs> I had the tiniest bit of eggs on there too. Just a little tiny bit. Yeah. Sorry for the little hissy fit I threw there. <laughs> oh, that one made me mad. song brought me luck. I told you it was a good luck song. Good luck jingle, I mean. Worked. I just wish, wish I could catch a fish, fish, so I could cook a dish, dish, and put it on YouTube. <laughs> Sucker went airborne. Yeah, that's the nicest fish I've seen all year. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, there should be. Got me tangled up. I lost it. No, it's another nice one, dude. All right, let's see if I can not sword jaw any more fish. Plan is is to not sore jaw anymore. Actually, get them in on the bank. Yeah. Oh, just got bit again. Oh. <laughs> No. Yep, we'll come down there. Oh. Maybe right here, Johnny. 
Oh yeah! <laughs> Woo! Thank you. Yeah! Finally. Shit, you're starting to nail them. Though. Woo! One for three. One for three. Finally. It's been a while. I right don't. He buried it too. Buried it. He really bit that one. Right on his tongue. It's the first time I've seen that. Don't bite me, buddy. Christmas time and everything, so been busy doing all that, but glad we got one. Got the fish. Here's the rest of the ingredients. It's everything we're gonna be using today for tonight for the catch and cook, so stick around, we're gonna get it started. And get the bacon going. That'll be the first thing. And then we're gonna and then we're gonna get the potatoes cut up. Get them boiling in the broth. I'm hungry. Bacon smells good. Okay, I'm gonna start cutting up the rest of this and wait for the bacon to cook and then we'll get the potatoes cut up, get the potatoes boiling in the broth and then everything else. It'll be done, it's gonna be good. Important part. What you gonna make, Ray? Buckskin bread. Ooh, your famous buckskin bread. Yeah. <laughs> All right. She's gonna make the buckskin bread. Whatever one you want. Let me just dice these guys up. Dice up the potatoes. I guess I should stick the potatoes here. Get those going first because they're gonna take the longest to get cooked. Skinned half the fish. I'm gonna cut it in tiny little chunks, bite-sized chunks for the Soup. This will be the last thing that goes in so it's going to cook the fastest. So, yeah, just little tiny squares, little bite sized pieces of fish. Get the rest of this skinned out. If you kind of slice right down by the bone, you can just grab onto these bones and just peel them out of there. Cut as close as you possibly can to them so then they peel out easy. And you can just grab them with your nail, feel where they are. Grab them with your nail and just pull them out. There's Yeah, there you go. Took all the bones out. I'm gonna put a little bit of, well, if you can read, you can read it. <laughs> it's like, uh, it's pretty much Johnny seasoning in a different type, but I'm gonna season my fish just a little bit. 
Yeah, season the fish a little bit just to get a bit a little more flavoring. I'm gonna throw these carrots in. In goes the celery. for a while let all these veggies cook and leak some flavor into our broth and then next we add the fish and bacon and then a little bit of heavy cream a little bit of heavy cream to make it like the chowder in case you guys I don't think you guys have met Raylan she's my daughter she's the one that's making the tasty bread for us today she's my oldest I don't think she's made a video yet, been in a video yet, so in case you were wondering, that's my daughter right there. Look at the fish. Oh, look at the fish. It's going to be a good meal. I can't wait. Alright, we'll see you in a little while. Wouldn't be a meal without one of these. in there that cooks really fast. I'm gonna throw the bacon in. <laughs> there we go. Mm -mm, it is starting to look like something. Look at that. That's what I'm gonna be eating right there. And the heavy cream. Almost forgot an important ingredient. Mm. Wouldn't have been the same without the corn. Need the corn in there. It's an important part to this to this meal. There we go. Now it looks good. Looks even better now. I can't believe I almost forgot that. It's one of my favorite parts of this meal. It's the corn. Mm -hmm. There we go, there's the meal. We got the soup and raised buckskin bread. Let's go, time to eat. Alright, well. Here we are. Got my buckskin bread and my soup. Mm hmm. Mm. That is good. Well, I hope you guys liked the episode. I hope you enjoy the recipe. If you do try it, I probably wasn't very good at <laughs> doing a kitchen cook, but if you, uh, if you try it out, let me know how good it was. I really like it. We really like it. So try it out. I'll try and make a list of things that I use. So anyway, yeah. Hope you enjoyed this video. Hope you enjoy the recipe. Thanks for watching. We'll see you guys next time.